Now to coverage from Trumbull County, a man is accused of leading police on a chase through Howland and Warren. At times, speeds reach close to 100 miles per hour. 27 First News reporter Nadine Grimley talked to the suspect's mother just after her son was arraigned. Appearing in Warren Municipal Court by video, 31-year-old Maurice Cox was arraigned on multiple felony charges, including failure to comply and felonious assault, all in connection to Wednesday's police chase. He was wrong, and he was, but he's human also. He made a mistake, a great mistake, a, a terrible mistake. And I'm so glad no one was killed or hurt. Cox is accused of taking off when a Howland officer tried pulling him over for not having a rear license plate and ramming into two Howland police cruisers. The chase went into Warren. A police report says Cox reached speeds of 90 to 100 miles per hour before he crashed into a field near Halliday Street and took off running. A warrant officer broke his ankle chasing after Cox. One from Howland was also taken to the hospital as a precaution. Cox was apprehended but treated for breathing issues before he was taken to the county jail where he'll remain for at least 23 more days after a judge imposed a sentence for failing to pay fines and costs in a different case. You missed your fines and costs hearing date. Once you miss your fines and costs hearing date, that's it. A preliminary hearing will be set within 10 days on the charges related to this case. In Warren, Nadine Grimley, WKBN 27 First News.